this is Apple Funk and welcome back to the channel. First time guest, welcome to you also. Thank you very much for stopping by. Uh, definitely appreciate it. Let's get into it. Today's another episode of Apple's Lawn and Garden. We are in the garden. Today I'm going to be taking out this broccoli. And hopefully I'll do it to give you a little tour. See this? There you go right there. That's that little broccoli. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and get this out of there. Uh, let me see if I can. I'll get it right eventually where I'll go right over it. But yeah, see that's what we're taking out today. And I did figure out a couple of things. <clears throat> one is that that remember how small that was look at it look it's really filling out really nice and you know about our, our lettuce over there we're still doing good on the lettuce so I figured out these are not carrots folks <laughs> these are carrots and you don't want to see one look at this I can't pull them up yet because they're not ready but if you dig down and oh, this one's really deep let me get one that's closer to the top, maybe. We don't really know how deep it is, but let's pull back this, this big one here and see if we can see some orange. Man, this thing's so deep. Uh, I feel something. No, a little bit, see? It's a little bit of orange. It's a little tiny carrot right now. I know I probably damaged them, but it'll be okay. We'll put them back. <coughs> let's... let's are my hands is sticking to a velcro that's on there anyway that's what we're doing we're going to pull up and transplant these um broccoli this broccoli so oh and oh before i get started my buddy has a either a family member or a friend that's a grand gardener and they get seeds from all over the place and and he bought me a bunch of different seeds. Uh, so that's pretty exciting. Um, I've got a lot of different seeds. <clears throat> so we'll see how this stuff comes up today. I watered it when I got home, just so it might be a little softer. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and get into it and see if we can not do too much damage. Okay. So that one came up pretty good. All right, we got some unintended some guests though we got to get rid of the guest oh man this is damaging right here okay all right see look at that little carrot you see him we'll plant him back in the ground but there he is that's a tiny little one right there so let's stick him back in the ground he's traumatized we traumatized the poor carrot <laughs> Uh, and we'll come back and do better. We'll do better. We'll get them. So where'd I put that plant? Here it is. Okay, we got no stragglers in there, so this all can go into that pot. And this won't be too long of a video because I don't have that much broccoli. I have some, and the only reason I know it's broccoli is because I haven't identified like two things that are left. I don't know what they are. <laughs> I know what I planted, and by process, of elimination I'm able to deduce but I'm still just not certain look at all of this corn I'm doing so much damage oh my gosh but oh gracious this is this is a boy oh come on out oh I can just feel the plants yelling at me saying why are you doing this to us <laughs> <laughs> but I have to in order to save them. In order to rescue the plants. I have to uh, I have to thin them out. They're just gonna choke each other out. And everything's well, look at these little, a bunch of little baby carrots. There's little carrots on every one of those. So let's put these over here. Oh man, this is 
so much damage, but I'm going to fix it. I have always fixed it. <laughs> yeah, I've always fixed it. So it's not going to look good for a couple of days. You know, not a couple of days, probably about two weeks. It's going to really look awful. And uh, we're just going to have to grin and bear it. put that many seeds in a tiny little box <laughs> this is what happened <laughs> and then you don't label anything uh, you know all the things all the things you should probably never ever do well never I've done in this box you know, but it's a resilient box it's very resilient you know I mean it's it's like, hey, what do you got? What do you got for us today? <laughs> How are you going to uh, mistreat us and mishandle us today, Apple Funk? And I always answer appropriately, like, in many ways. <laughs> in many ways. Yeah, we got a nice little chunk right here, see? Look at that right there, see? We gotta get some of this, all this out of there. Not all of it, but we're good. We'll keep that much, that's good. Uh, man, yeah, we had more than I thought, to be honest with you. Okay. We had more than I thought. Okay. <clears throat> but once I put these alone, man, I got so much work to do with this. It's deflating. <sighs> but once again, we gotta we gotta tame this tame this garden. We can't let it control us. If it gets totally out of hand, then what? You know? Then what? Then that's no fun. Who wants that? Yeah, we can't all of this. I only have a couple more. Let me, let me face it out with you. See if I can get you in what I got going on here. All right. Oh, no. Damn it. <laughs> this box is going to hate me. tangled and oh damage the damage I'm doing I know I know I keep repeating myself but you know I've tended to this garden and to do what I'm doing to it hurts me it hurts my feelings to do this to this the garden but I think in the end it's the best way you know to get a really big crop off of them you know let these plants be the best they can be Oh, sorry. <laughs> I grabbed the cord. I need to put it over here. Okay, uh, last one. Let's just go for it, right? Don't baby it. Get it out of the ground so you can. I heard the rips and the tears. Oh, gosh. Okay, well, this is the last little bit. Um, is there, yeah, I see there's some carrots in that too, right in there. See, that's a carrot. So we got to get that carrot out of there. And he's all bald and intertwined and everything. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. There you go. All right, we're going to put you over here. And I, nope, we have and the one right here. We could throw him with his folks. And this is a carrot here. So we'll put him here. And we got one here we're intertwined with these are onions these are onions these need to go over here all right this goes here and there we go we have officially taken all of the broccoli out of this box now we need to repair this box man all right stop whining all right here's a
bring some stuff up. Yeah? Bring it up from all that nastiness we put it down in. Yeah, let's just do here. We got a couple more things here. Here's another little carrot, little baby carrot. Oh, I think it's too close. There we go. Yeah. Let's put this carrot here. What do we got? More carrots? Yes. Let's get them right in the middle. There you go, little fella. Uh, there's some more Swiss shard, but it just couldn't breathe, so we freed it. We freed it up. So, um, what do we got? I think everything else is, is is in the ground. It's in the ground. I gotta water it in, and I can do that really quick, and then I can get over here and put these uh oh we got some more stuff under here that we're freeing up um we can get in the other box with the onions and transplant those and get those in and then we'll plant these and then put some more dirt and then we'll be done so let me um i guess i don't really need to move i got it set up pretty good don't i <laughs> it's a day <laughs> okay so let's just go ahead and get these onions in there with the rest of the fold. All right, yeah, we get all this stuff. See, look, we got the, this big bundle right here. Let me turn you around. There, there we go. So we're just sticking them right in. There, there we go. So we're just sticking them right in here. All right, right them on the edge. I'm getting some dirt on them. And like I guess I did water today. So, you know, everything's pretty pliable. All right, let's get these in the ground. Like I said, they're gonna have some trouble over the next few days trying to adjust, but that is where they belong. Here's one more I left in the other box. I gotta get it, I left. I just now saw it. So you in there. These onions are big onions. These aren't small onions that, I'm plant, that I planted. <laughs> these are really fat onions. <clears throat> so, there you go, come on, give it up. Let's see right there. Uh, let's get it in here right here. Sorry. All right, so we got those transplanted. What's next? What are we doing next? Uh, we went ahead and prepared this box earlier today um, before I got on. So all we would have to do is grab them and dig and plant. See how easy that was? I mean, we didn't make a big fuss about it. We just grabbed it, stuck it in the ground. And all these things want to be planted. They want to be in the ground. So let's get this guy here and get them in the ground. Yeah, we're gonna, you know, I have to look online to figure out when stuff is ready to pick. I have no idea. So and it told me there one day, I said, yeah, look for, dig down for the carrots or the orange and look at the diameter. And if the diameter is, you know, of a, I think it was like thumb, but, you know, mine's a less than a baby's finger <laughs> at this point. So, uh, <clears throat> but yeah, this was, this, this was going to be the easy part. It was always going to be the easiest part. It was uh, getting this stuff. I was looking forward to this part because that would have meant that I was really close to being done. And I am. Uh. Like I said, I wouldn't normally do this, but I'll pick up some more and probably replace this. But it might be the best thing these plants have ever seen. Who knows? But the stuff I buy anyway is the good grain vegetable soil. Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, let's, let's just fill it in. We'll probably put a light dusting on the, um, put a light dusting on the, uh, that portion of the garden too, because maybe there's some exposed roots that I can uh, accidentally cover up just by just by sprinkling a little bit of 
this mix in there and I'm going to water all of this in so uh, it's not going to be final like this. So two over here. Oh, Millie. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do a little bit in here. We're going to have to move this camera. We can push you out here. Right? Yeah. There we go. All right. So we'll, we'll be real light with it. Like I said, I'm just trying to, and I might accidentally cover a root that might have been exposed had it not been for this. So, see, I mean, the stuff I get doesn't have a block in it. You know, this is garbage. Miracle Girl potting mix, though, so, you know, we'll see. But why does it have a rock in it? Yeah. You know? It's ridiculous. I know, I, I know. This, this, it just upsets me. It's like, you know, what else do they have to do? You know, what else do they have to do? Keep the rocks out of the daggone potting mix. This ain't had rocks. Premium potting soil. Nitrogen phosphate derived from a portion of the nitrogen phosphate in potash has been coated, blah, blah, blah. Slow release. Ingredients. <clears throat> this product is formulated from one or more of the following. Processed forest products. Oh, well. Never mind. I, I, rocks are in the forest. Okay, so. All right, cool. Um, that's it. Oh, no, no, no. no, no. We gotta put some of this processed forest soil <laughs> around my, uh, my newly planted little onions over here. Yeah, yeah, there. Shake it down, shake it down, shake it down. Alright. There we go. Now I'll water it in. Have to, have to be real careful not to wet up the camera. Oh, my seat's wet. But that's okay. Anyway, this has been another episode of Apple's Lawn and Garden. I uh, definitely appreciate you watching. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day. See you next time.